Electrotherm, Gulf Coast Green Energy, and a major oil and gas company commissioned the first flare elimination system using heat to power technology. Located at an oil well in North Dakota, Electrotherm's Power Plus generator captures the natural gas that would otherwise be flared to generate low emission electricity and reduce or eliminate on site flaring. Gas is commonly flared to avoid venting to the atmosphere at sites where infrastructure is not in place to capture and utilize the resource. In North Dakota's Bakken oil fields, nearly 30% of gas is flared. In 2014, North Dakota mandated flare reduction for oil producers over the coming years, backed by significant penalties for non-compliance. Electrotherm utilizes organic rank and cycle and proprietary technologies to generate power from low temperature heat. At the oil well, natural gas that would otherwise be flared is instead used to fuel an industrial boiler. The boiler heats water to run the Power Plus generator, which produces clean energy that can offset local loads or be exported to the grid. The boiler precisely controls the fuel-to-air mixture, ensuring clean combustion that results in very low emissions, especially compared to typical on-site generation equipment such as a reciprocating engine. 9 ppm NOx is easily achievable. Additional benefits include accepts raw and untreated gas or fuel gas, provides responsible methane utilization, no capital intensive engine or turbine power generators, and low maintenance. This is a great application for our product line. We're capturing a natural resource that was previously being wasted in a flare and putting it to work making clean electricity. The product is scalable and modular and very robust, and we see a lot of applications for this beyond the wellhead. Anywhere the gas is being flared, this can be used, such as wastewater treatment plants and landfills. Learn more about Electrotherm and its waste heat to power technology at electrotherm.com. Special thanks to our partners on this project, Gulf Coast Green Energy, the Houston Advanced Research Center, and its environmentally friendly drilling systems program.